What diagnostic indicators should clinicians look for in Takayasu's arteritis? Definition. Takayasu's arteritis is a rare form of vasculitis that involves inflammation and stenosis of medium to large arteries, particularly the aortic arch and its branches. Statistics. 1. Takayasu's arteritis has a prevalence of about 2.6 cases per million people. 2. The condition predominantly affects females, with a female-to-male ratio of about 9 to 1. 3. It most often starts between ages 15 and 35. 4. Up to 50% of patients may experience ocular disturbances. 5. Elevated ESR and CRP are seen in approximately 80% of patients. 5 Facts 1. Takayasu's arteritis primarily affects medium and large arteries. 2. It often involves thickening of the aortic arch and proximal great vessels. 3. Weak pulses in the upper extremities are a characteristic feature, often called, pulseless disease. 4. Ocular disturbances such as blurry vision or transient blindness can also occur. 5. This condition is more prevalent in women and generally manifests between the ages of 15 and 35. Clinical Scenario A 38-year-old female patient comes in complaining of recurring headaches, fatigue, and generalized malaise. She also reports experiencing dizziness and blurry vision over the last few months. On physical examination, the pulses in her upper extremities are noticeably weak. Diagnostic Tests and Imaging To consider a diagnosis of Takayasu's arteritis, blood tests showing elevated erythrocyte sedimentation rate ESR, and C-reactive protein CRP, are often indicative of inflammation. Imaging modalities such as magnetic resonance angiography MRA, or a Doppler ultrasound can show characteristic findings like stenosis or thickening of the aortic arch and its major branches. For more information, for comprehensive details on Takayasu's arteritis, please consult specialized literature and guidelines from reliable medical organizations like the American College of Rheumatology or the National Organization for Rare Disorders, NORD.